Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Transgression by Dr. A. He specifically requested that I play it in a video, not a live stream, but that didn't stop me from accidentally loading it up in the last live stream, walking around for a bit, and then exiting the map when I realized I wasn't supposed to be playing it yet. So, yeah, you might have seen me read the description before, but we'll read it again. Cave here. I wanted to let yous know that we seem to have crossed a line. Budget line, to be precise. If someone doesn't own up to spending all our funds on a lifetime supply of macaroni, it won't be pretty. I promise, macaroni will be everywhere, just like Nana's 67th birthday. Anyway, this test is dangerous. Some Yahoo, I'm looking at you, Jeff, decided to replace all our non-deadly laser grids with actually deadly la laser grids. Said it looked better. Harumph. Cave Johnson, we're done here. Special thanks to Hanky Mueller and Libby Bapa for help with playtesting and puzzle help. Yes, so... This is one of the many alternate universe caves that apparently says use. Interesting. Right, well, let's go ahead and get started, shall we? I think, I think the extent of me walking around... ...was to go... Yeah, I vaguely remember this. Vaguely. I th think- oh yes, I can pull myself up there. So we can do this. Because we can't really do much else right now. We have a button that goes to the door in the funnel that I said I liked. And, uh... Then we can- we can go over here. Experiment with that, and then I went in here, and then... I think I was in here, investigating this button that we can press from this side of the fizzler when I realized... Somebody pointed out in chat that I wasn't supposed to be in this map. So yeah, don't worry, we haven't- we haven't really messed up too much. So from here on out, it's completely blind. I have no knowledge of this map. There's more? Holy goodness. Also, I tilted this companion cube by accident. There we go. That's interesting. Hmm... Well, might as well try this first, right? I could lift cubes over that fizzler, interestingly enough. Is that intended? Am I supposed to be able to lift cubes over that fizzler? Also, this is a good song from Rexora, by the way. Made by Mivius himself. Ho 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 ho! Now that is scary! Hmm. I suppose that works. What does this do? When does this do? Oh, I can't use it like that. Okay. I don't remember seeing circle. Oh, that's circle. There it is. I have a feeling we might want to swap these cubes. Will we have to live a cube over the, the fizzler to do it, though? I could have done that from the beginning, right? Couldn't I? Yeah, I can do that. Am I not supposed to be able to? That seems so intentional, though. <laughs> 
So we can do that, and then walk through here, carefully. Run for it! And it tilted. Of course it did. That's almost right. There we go, oh that's right. And we can put this here. But then what? Well, we've swapped the cubes, at least. Is there a portal surface anywhere out here at all? Oh, there is! How did I not see that before? I made this entirely more complicated than it needed to be, I didn't even need to swap the cubes the way I did. Yeah, I totally overcomplicated that. There we go! Like a normal person would do it. Wait, now the question is... Which cube do I want on which button? Cause I can recall this one... Oh, I have to stand on that button myself. Interesting. I think I do want the companion cube. I think this is the proper way to do things. Very nicely laid out. So if we do this. Oh, we can get both cubes in there. Oh, that's interesting. Might as well do that, right? Let's see what we can do with the regular cube. Um... You know I can just leave now, right? There's nothing stopping me from leaving. Except for whatever just happened there. Why did the cube take so long to pick up? That was strange. Yeah, uh, I think- I think you're gonna wanna make this wall a bit thicker or something. Maybe- maybe change that to just a corner instead of a nice angled slope. Alright, well. How about we go back and do this the intended way? See, we'll put this back on here after I fix. Actually, is it? No, it's not. Okay. There we go. Hmm. I suppose I could actually go into that room, right? I don't think I even tried going into that room. How would you get out? Oh, this door opens. Okay. But it's got a fizzler. Okay, so that's if you come in here without the cube, I imagine. Mmm. 
Light idea. Wait. That's not gonna work. How do I get that cube out of there? What do I do about that cube? Oh, I see how this works. I'm bad with funnels. Come to me, cube. That's one cube across. And it's already upright. Hmm. I do believe I just screwed up. No, I didn't. Because I can do this. No problem. But how do I get in there now? Um... Oh yeah, I screwed up big time. <laughs> I'm gonna put this guy back. That from whence it came. This again. It's very nice I don't have to reload a quick save, because I haven't been quick saving. Very good puzzle design. I like this a lot. I'm actually gonna add this to my favorites already. The trick, I believe, is that I need to do something with this button here. You put it on this button, that gets it reversed, right? If I can do that, that doesn't help. I'm not supposed to put the cube on the edge of the button, pretty sure. Pretty sure I'm not supposed to put the cube on the edge of the button. That would just make too much sense. How do I get back in that room now? I can't just walk in there, can I? Nope. That is not a thing I can do. Ooh, pretty colors! Alright, um... I don't think I'm supposed to be able to make this shot. I don't think it matters too much, though. No, I don't want to do that. Right?
I go over here, right? Oh my gosh, I just wanna look over here for a second. No, I can't access any portable surfaces... there. I'm not gonna recall... that guy. Yeah, I needed to get both cubes in here to do what I'm doing, right? I'm not very good with funnels, though, so... Like, if I was supposed to push or pull the cube off the button, it would have been put in front of the portal surface, but it's put to the side. If we reset to when I had the cube in the funnel like this, just grabbed it out of the funnel, right? If I just set it down here... I mean, that lets me do this now. That's not helpful. And I can at least get back now without no clipping. I could get that- I could get both cubes stuck in there, <laughs> without me. I don't think that would be helpful, though. What is that signage? Hmm... I need to have a portal there, and the only ground-level portal services I can access are that one... ...and that one, but I can't actually get to it, because nothing turns off this death grill at all. That means I need some way to put a portal there, and then also be over here, but that doesn't seem possible. And, like, even if I suck myself all the way through the funnel to here, I'd have no portals placed. I could shoot a portal there, but then... Then that... that's not useful, because then all I can do is fall out of the funnel. I can't take this cube off the button from in the funnel. Am I missing something? Did I trap myself? What's going on here? How... How can I not figure out a way to get that cube out now? I can't even get into that room. I think I'm gonna have to be right back. Alright, so, using my detective skills, I have deduced that everybody who has left a comment on this map has solved it the unintended way. <laughs> Namely, uh, either... either they- they did this little- this little crouch- crouch angle here, that's not supposed to be possible, or they- they just, you know, uh, did what I did, or- yeah, sounds like that. 
Most people, pretty much if nobody, nobody has used that button right there. I'm the only person who has used that button, so I need to ask a hint from Dr. A, or see if I can find Nox playthrough. Maybe he used the button, I don't know. Be right back again. Alright, so, I spoke with some other people who have played this map, or at least looked into it. And we've all come to the conclusion that if you put a cube on that button and leave the room, there is no way to get back in. That is a trapping situation. Well, technically you're not trapped because you just have to restart the whole map from the beginning by going through here. But, uh... Actually, I think it is a trapping No, no, because, uh, well, hmm. Somehow, I think it's a trapping situation at some point, but... Yeah, let's- let's just restart this from the beginning, and we'll try doing the map a different way. Probably not the intended way. I don't think there is an intended way in this version of the map. If there is, Dr. A has not responded to me in any form or fashion at the time of recording this, at least. So I'm just gonna have to push through, and do this whatever way I see fit. So let's go ahead and take this compute cube over here. I noticed when Deathwish played, he actually didn't use the funnel to push the cubes in there, he just stuck them in there by hand. I thought that was pretty interesting. So there seems to be multiple ways to approach this map. I still like some parts of it, so it's still on my favorites, but... It seems kinda broken at the moment. <laughs> uh, let's see... Yeah, let's do that. And that. Da 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 da! There we go. Please don't kill me! There we go. And then... Right. Wait, that's backwards. Cause eventually... yeah, whatever, eventually I'm gonna have a funnel coming out of here, so... Well, actually it doesn't matter, cause... I don't think... I don't know which way I'm gonna do this, to be honest. how Deathwish did it. Cause he didn't- he sure as heck didn't use the funnel. I don't remember. Alright, we need to... swap these. I'll just do it my way. Oh right, he just did that. And this is off. Right, <laughs> yeah. So... Instead of using the funnel... You can just do... that. <laughs> and then you can walk through here. And then you can respawn regular cube. Oops, come on. Give me a regular cube. And you can also respawn the companion cube from here as well. And there you go. Don't even have to use the funnel. Yeah, I think this map needs some adjusting. Right, so then the other thing... You can just put that through there, right? I think everybody just uses this little... teeny tiny way... Well, not- not very tiny. Like, this is pretty obvious, like, I'm not sure how Dr. A managed to miss this major glaring hole here. Like, just putting some glass in the way would help, maybe. Hmm, how do we want to go about doing this? Eh, let's just do it that way, I guess. Until Dr. A fixes it, this is the way we're gonna do things around here. Yeah, everybody said that they- they- once they went in- they- they used that room to funnel themselves up and then they never actually entered that room, so... I'm sure there's some forgotten intentions in here somewhere. Right, and then... We do that. And that. And that's it. Yep, that's what we're gonna do for now. I will replay it when you fix it, Dr. A. So, uh, 
Oh, yes. Get out of the way. Thank you. So, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!